Hello students, in today's practical, we are going to study about the titration. The titration is the redox titration between KMnO4 and Mohr salt. Let us read out the aim. First of all, we have to prepare 250 ml M by 20, that is 0.5 molar solution of Mohr salt. Mohr salt is a double salt. By preparing that Mohr salt, we have to calculate the strength and molarity of the unknown KMnO4 solution given to us. Let us go with the theory. The reaction between KMnO4 and Mohr salt is a redox reaction and the titration is therefore known as redox titration. Mohr salt is a reducing agent and KMnO4 is an oxidizing agent. KMnO4 acts as an oxidizing agent in all the mediums like acidic, basic and neutral. But it behaves as the strongest or a better oxidizing agent in an acidic medium. Hence, for the reaction, in today's practical, we are going to take a dilute sulfuric acid as a medium. Let us see the ionic equations going into the reactions. If you see the reduction half, you will find that MnO4 reacts with H plus ions with an exchange of 5 electrons to give you Mn plus 2 ions. That means here MnO4 where Mn has plus 7 oxidation state reduces to Mn plus 2. In the oxidation half, if you see the reaction that Fe plus 2 ions that is ferrous ions reacts to give ferric ion. Overall if you see the reaction goes like MnO4 plus 8 hydrogen ions plus 5 ferrous ion gives Mn plus 2 plus 5 ferric ions plus 4 water molecules. Let us start the titration. First of all, use pipette to take out Mohar salt. The molarity of Mohar salt is M by 20. Using your thumb, adjust a zero mark on the pipette and transfer Mohar salt into the conical flask. Ensure that the tip of the pipette touches the glass of the conical flask. Do not blow out the last drop from the pipette. As the KMnO4 works good oxidizing agent in the acidic medium, here we are using sulfuric acid, dilute sulfuric acid that is approximately little half, more half than the test tube and Transfer it into the conical flask. Stir the solution well and the solution is ready for the titration. Here the burette is already filled with the KMnO4 with a zero mark. Add KMnO4 drop by drop till we get the permanent pink color as an end point for the titration. Ensure constant stirring of the solution. While adding KMnO4, if you find the pink color comes into the entire bulk, that means that the titration end point is very near. Just add one extra drop to ensure the permanent pink color of the solution. Note down the burette reading. Here in this practical, the reading is 9.8 ml. Let us talk about the observation table. Here you can see the observation table. We are going to take three readings. The burette readings, initial reading and the final reading. 
for the practical what we have seen the concordant reading came out to be 9.8 ml similarly we have to prepare the table this is an example for you after writing the observation table let us see the calculation for calculation let us use the formula a1 m1 v1 is equal to a2 m2 v2 let us take the left hand side as a kmno4 potassium permanganate and the right hand side as a mohr salt now the activity for kmno4 is 5 times the molarity of kmno4 that is unknown to us let us take as m1 into the volume of kmno4 that is our concordant reading that is 9.8 ml that is equal to right hand side let us take uh, activity of mohr salt is 1 molarity of mohr salt already we have taken as 0 0.05 molar into the volume of mohr salt that is our pipette reading which we have taken as 10 ml so if I take M1 as subject, I will get M1 is equal to 1 into 0 0.05 into 10 divided by 5 into 9.8. And this comes out to be 0 0.01 molar and that is approximate. So here how we can calculate the molarity of the unknown solution of the KMNO4. Now let us calculate the strength. Strength of KMNO4. For the formula we know that it is equal to molarity of KMNO4 multiplied by molar mass of KMNO4. Molarity we just have calculated as 0 0.01 molars into molar mass of KMNO4 that is 158 grams per liter and when we do the calculation it comes out to be 1.58 grams per liter this is how we calculate the strength of KMNO4